Let's see what we have. This is Instagram, right? Turn off request to go live, number one. All right, I think that put everybody on there. I think everybody is here. What's up? Hi, everybody. Y'all in here? Okay, okay, okay. We live, we live, we live, we live. I ain't been on here so long. Jesus. Okay, baby, I have not been on here in forever. You know why? Too busy traveling, man. All right, let's give you a discount code for this evening. Let's do that. Why don't we do a discount code? We shall make the a discount code. Wait, let me deactivate. I think I had piano on last time, right? I haven't taken piano off. That's just how crazy it's been around here. I have not taken off piano. Let me see. Piano. Oh, it's expired. All right. So tonight's discount code, why don't we do a discount off of products? Let's do, let's do 40%. I can do that. The code is butter, B-U-T-T-E-R, 40%. Um, did I see? I think I saw Janelle on here, didn't I? There she goes. Add as a moderator. Confirm. Uh, 40% off specific collection. So why don't we do 40% off of aprons, cookbooks, cookware, hoodies, t-shirt, cocktail, wine glasses. Including the knife that's now, uh-oh. Oh, we use butter already. We got to use something different. Um, cupcake. Cupcake. Say. All right. There we have it. Cupcake is the code for tonight. She works. Let me make, let me make sure. Hold on. Cupcake. We live, baby. What's up, people? Hopefully, y'all are good. Let's make a fucking cocktail. Let's go. All right. I'm going to do this in a blender. So let me grab some ice. Into this blender, let's add a couple things that I think will be great. A little bit of white peach syrup. To that, I'm gonna add a little bit of sweet and sour. Four ingredients, making it real easy, all right? A little bit of, this is lychee liqueur, all right? It adds a beautiful tropical flavor to just about anything, all right? And I'm really going for more like a frozen daiquiri situation, so let's call it a white peach lychee, okay? Frozen daiquiri. I'm using whiskey, though, but whatever, or uh, peach crown, so call it what you want. I'm going to call it delicious, okay? It's summertime still. It's peach still, and we have a theme still, okay? We just gonna put us a, you know, this is really as a much as you need situation. <laughs> this really, I want you to put as much as you need. You feel me? You may not need that much. Maybe you, ha maybe your day was not like a Monday, so maybe you don't need that much. Maybe you only need you a little piece. You see what I'm saying?
Welcome. <laughs> Let me get the base of the blender. Okay, let me tell you something. Sometimes, baby, you just got to do what you got to do. Get what you need out of kitchen therapy tonight. You see what I'm saying? If you need a little something, this is a service where you come and you get exactly what you need. You understand me? All right, let's plug this up in the blender. You know, ain't nothing ready. Oh, and let me go check this air conditioning too. I think the air conditioning went off. Let me make a drink first. Here we go. Hello. Don't she? Baby, she blends, don't she? She don't need no, she don't need no, um, she don't need no garnish. Huh? They're gonna get in the way. These are glasses at the Darius Cooks wine glass collection. Go to shopdariuscooks.com. Discount code tonight, 40% off. Discount code tonight is the word cupcake. Mm. At this time, we asking all visitors to please stand while I go check on the air conditioning. At this time, we'd like to welcome you to service tonight. We realize it's by no accident that you're here. It's by God's divine providence. We really do hope that this evening something is said or done that encourages your heart for you to come back and join us again. Now, at this time, we do have impact agents coming from the rear of the sanctuary to hand you an information card. We do ask that when you go around for offering, you put the information card in the basket so we can stay in contact with you, all right? And I want you to go to the west vestibule after service to claim your free gift. Do not go to the east vestibule. The east vestibule is for our senior sign-up. The people down at the dentistry school, they need some volunteers on the new denture technology. So if you're around here, Ball head by the gums, and you a senior, you can go down and sign up in the East Vestibule and go down to the students at the dentist school, and they can outfit you with their new technology. God bless you. At this time, we'd like to welcome you. Let the foodie in me, love the foodie in you, let the foodie in me. Love the food in, in you, cause you're easy. Mm, 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 mm. You're easy. Mm, 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 mm. You're easy. Bop, 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 bop. Easy to love. You may be seated in his presence. I was glad when they said unto me, let us go into the kitchen and cook together. Okay. We got a little work to do tonight. Okay. We got us a little work to do. But I believe the children are our future. Teach them well and let them lead the way. Mm. Knives are in stock too. 
FYI, new knife alert. Four piece set. Now where's the four piece out there? Let me find the, hold on. Let me find the four piece. This is how we, I got it. All right, this is the last time I'm changing the handle on the everyday knife, all right? But you have the Darius Cooks everyday knife, which y'all love, back in stock, shop, shop DariusCooks.com. The Santuco, also available, shop DariusCooks.com. Tonight, it's available. The serrated knife is available at shop DariusCooks.com. And the six inch paring knife is also available with the blonde wood. It is available for you at shopdariuscooks.com. Okay? The black ground is horrible. Black. You don't have to worry about the background ever again. Bye, Zach. We'll see you later. Let me get a bowl. Let's go. We got stuff to do. I, I can't play with y'all today. Okay? I can't. I can look at the comments. Which we have a lot of work to do. Okay? All right. Step one is we're going to get us a bowl. Okay. Step one. We're going to get you a bowl. Like about like right here. Like one of these. See? And then let me show you how easy this is to do. Okay, we're gonna make us, now I was in Nashville. You already know where it's going. I was in, I happened to be in Nashville a couple weeks ago. And when I was in Nashville, I went to a cupcake place that I didn't particularly care for, but they were voted number one cupcake in the city, in the state, child, in the whole state. They was voted number one. And let me tell you what I said. I said, honey, if you voted number one, you voted number one because somebody is buying your cupcakes. May not be me, but somebody is out here patronizing. So let me tell you something. Don't listen to nothing I got to say. You know what I'm saying? Listen to your customers. I ain't like the cupcakes. Quiet as it's kept, y'all don't either. <laughs> I ain't gonna put you on blast, but you know who you are. Okay? I am not putting you on blast, but don't you sit up here and act like you didn't inbox me and tell me there he is. I don't like him either. Now, I'm the king of a receipt. If you just started watching me, hello. My name is Darius Receipt Williams, also known as Darius Cooks on social media, okay? What I'm trying to tell you is, y'all said the same thing and want to act like you didn't say it. problem here because what, what can I do? Chew my cabbage twice. Buttermilk. I like using buttermilk for my cakes and cupcakes because they stay extra moist with the buttermilk. Okay? Now, you could do the creaming method. Butter, sugar. I don't have that kind of time. Oh my hands, since you've been away, boy. I ain't got no plans, no, 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 no. Y'all really cut up too, over them cupcakes, okay? Baby, I said I ain't like them cupcakes, oh boy. And then, TMZ gonna get, not TMZ, who that is? Dish Nation. Got it all wrong. I said to myself, I never said that. That's 
not what I said. And this nation was like, K. Michelle said about the cupcakes. Girl, K. Michelle live in um, Memphis. K. Michelle do not live in the 615. What is y'all talking about? They had it all wrong. See, that's why I tell you my business because everybody else tell you my business the wrong way. And I don't be liking that, okay? All right, we put buttermilk. By the way, this recipe is in storage from my grandmother's kitchen. The base is, all right? Buttermilk, sugar, and oil. That's all we did. Measurements, if you really want the measurements. Cup and a half of buttermilk, cup of uh, non-flavored oil, two cups of granulated sugar, okay? Notice I'm using a spoon, not a mixer, because that's how easy this is to make a perfect cupcake. Don't do that. Don't do that. See, that's what I <laughs> Won't God get you together in front of everybody? <laughs> Won't God humble you in front of everybody? I said perfect cupcake and then couldn't even crack an egg, okay? There you go. Won't God humble you? Won't God say, uh, excuse me, sir. My bad, God. I mean it. Then he gonna say, you lying to me? You know I know your thoughts. Well, okay. <laughs> Let's flavor this. You know what I like, all right? A little bit of vanilla. Depends on what flavor you're going, but vanilla go with everything. And yes, put a lot of vanilla in so you can taste it. Y'all kill me with that little sprinkle of vanilla. You can't taste nothing but regret and sorrow. Okay, in that little bit of in that little bit of um vanilla y'all put in, you don't taste nothing there. You gotta really get in there and do it good if you're gonna do it. You gotta do it. Okay, break them eggs up. And no, I do not eat eggs, but I'm fat. And fat people like cake. So what you gonna deal with it? <laughs> that was somebody like cupcakes. I know. It got me right together, didn't it? Hold on, I'm out of salt in my little salt thing. I like to have my salt in a dish. That's just what I like. Do what you like, okay? A, <laughs> a pinch of salt. A pinch of salt. Now we're gonna put the rest of our dry ingredients. See how easy this is? I ain't did nothing but sip and drink, that's it. That's it, all I did was sip and drink. Okay, let's do uh, flour, all purpose. I'm not sifting. Two and a half cups. And this recipe can be like doubled or quadrupled or whatever you want to do. It's all, it come out good every single time. Okay, two and a half. And then you're going to need some baking soda, not baking powder. Baking soda. And again, if you need the recipe, it's in stories from our grandmother's kitchen. Only problem is they out of print right now, so you gotta give me a couple more months for it's back in print. But if you follow the red velvet cake recipe, obviously, and omit the, it's on page 229. This is the red velvet cake. If you omit the red food coloring and the chocolate, this is what we got, all right? Pretty simple, and uh, but you can get the electronic copies available. You can get that for 40% off by going to shopdariuscooks.com. Use the code CUPCAKE at checkout to say, okay? All right, you just wanna mix this 
until all of your flour comes together. Am I tipsy? No, I'm not tipsy. What do you mean tipsy? Me? Girl, no. Liquor don't bother me. I don't even like liquor. What are you talking about? This is it. We done. We did what we had to do. We have come to the end of the road. Okay? So that looks good. Now, we're going to have to make cupcakes, right? So, to do this, I'm going to use... They have, I bought like all kinds of cute cupcake liners. They have some really cute ones out there. Like, I thought these were really cute. Very non-African-American, but cute nonetheless, okay? Um, so I'm gonna just do four with this, but the other ones, I like the other ones a lot too. These little small babies. Yeah, I like these. In fact, I love these. Not like, I love these. Okay. Everybody's happy? Everybody settled? All right, let's get our pour on. I think the best way to do this is to grab you a picture. I'm gonna use the uh, Darius Cook's decanter. That's the first thing in my face. And I'm just going to try not to make a mess. Let's see what we can do. We're making a mess. Hold on. We're making a mess. The mouth isn't wide enough. That's what he said. It's like once I committed to it, I just had to go with it. Could I have gotten another cut, another measuring cup? Yeah, but I had already committed to it. So it was like, we're just gonna do what we came to do. Right? I already committed to it, it was too late. I had already committed to it. I mean, I could have used a measuring cup that probably would have been easier, but this was the first thing in my face, so. And I didn't do too bad. I only spilled a little bit, so. Your mama. 75% of the way up, you fill this up. You can do all that scooping and stuff. You gonna do all that. I don't got time for all that. I don't know how y'all do that. You know, all that scooping and. Use a um, ice cream scoop, Darius, it's even. Okay, honey, you do that. I'm gonna do this right here, what I'm doing. Pouring this with my hand on my hip, like somebody's grandmama with their hair tied up. Talking about some, close my front door. Letting all my air, what you trying to do? Cool off the whole neighborhood? And quit going in and out of my house. Make my cake fall, I'm gonna whoop your ass. Somebody's grandmama. I was raised around so many black women, I could be somebody to grandma, I bet. And I wear a moo moo. And I'm in it. Gay as shit with a moo moo on. Okay, oven's preheated to 350 degrees. <laughs> it's gonna go in until they're golden brown. See that? Real simple. Now you're gonna get a little spillage here and there. It's all right. Just wipe it up, girl. It's fine. Okay? This is absolutely okay. The, the cupcake is the discount code. So if you need something from my online store, go buy it and use the discount code cupcake at checkout to save 40%. Now I don't be doing these 40% a lot now, so heed ye, take advantage, okay? Now, we gotta do a little work. 
Let me see. Do I want a food processor or a blender? A blender. All right, first step is I'm gonna use the same blender I've been using, but my cocktail in here. I need to go wash it out. Don't worry about it. A whole can of peaches with the juice and everything. These are peaches from Publix, Church of God in Christ. But shopping is not a pleasure. You know what? I'm, I ain't going to lie. At Publix, shopping is a pleasure until it's time to pay. And you be like, now Publix, now you know what? What this don't make? No kind of sense, okay? I'm talking about no kind of sense. Okay, into a blender. This could be a food processor. It don't really have to be a blender. It could be a, whatever you want it to be. I'm gonna add in a taint of nutmeg. Just a taint. Y'all be going overboard and it be upsetting me and my homegirls, okay? Just a taint is all you need of nutmeg and a taint, a little more than a taint of cinnamon. Now, I don't really know what a taint is. I don't really know what a taint is. I don't know. A taint is like a little bit, like not a lot. This spoon is gonna drive me insane, hold on. <laughs> Can we get a bigger spoon, please? Okay, add some sugar. In here. Like, about that much. How much is that? That much. Okay. I'm also going to add half a stick of room temperature butter. Shout out to Facebook. If you know, you know. And then a little swig of vanilla, Ooh, like that. A little swig of vanilla, that'll help us out, okay? Now to that swig of vanilla, I think I got what, two more ingredients maybe to put in here? Somebody said something, a little cornstarch. No, three ingredients, cornstarch, A little accoutrement. Normally I do Hennessy, but in this case I'm doing peach in the blender. I might as well do peach whiskey to go with it. And then I'm going to use my Darius Cooks Santuco knife, which you can get at shopdariuscooks.com. Use the code uh, cupcake at checkout to save 40% while I am live only. Okay? Squeeze a fresh lemon. It don't even matter who scrolls it. All right, and then onto a blender she goes. Lid goes on. Power blend. <laughs> That's all she needs, all right? Now I'll show you the peach cobbler filling for our cupcakes, huh? I will show you, thank you. Okay, baby, I'm gonna show you how to make a cupcake. Cause I don't know what that was I had down over there, but that wasn't a cupcake. I don't know what it was I had in, in Nashville. I was not happy with that. So I'm going to show you better than I can tell you. This is our filling. This is a peach cobbler 
filling. It's got the butter. It's got the lemon juice. It's got the vanilla, the nutmeg, the cinnamon. This goes on the stove. A cute medium heat until she thickens. Done. Cute medium heat. Don't go overboard. Just a cute little medium heat. A cute medium heat. She'll come to a boil. Then she's done. But I will tell you, this is great not just for these cupcakes, but on toast, okay, over pound cake, you name it, you could do it. They said, you got me weak in the comments. <clears throat> TikTok is really going crazy, ain't they? TikTok, y'all all right? What I'm drinking? Uh, frozen daiquiri made from peach crown and lychee liqueur. Did I lose weight? It's a filter. Hold on, it's TikTok. <laughs> Let me play with them. They man, check them cornmeal cupcakes. I use flour, I ain't use cornmeal. Dye that beard, make some money. Quit being broke. You really wanna go there? Baby, I'm lit and petty, okay? Honey, you're watching me. I am not watching you. You understand that? Huh. You are watching me in my kitchen. I am not watching you. I've already won. Thank you. Now, while the cupcakes are cupcaking, let's make the we'll make the frosting later. Let's make this um this um this sauce. You need you a skillet. <coughs> Perhaps an everyday skillet. With, with my name on it. TikTok hater, where's your skillet? With your name on it. In fact, where's your live stream? Where you're demonstrating what you know how to do best. You don't have one? I didn't think so. Oh, I got skillets out already. By the way, if you need a skillet, I've got them on sale at shopdariuscooks.com. Use the code cupcake at checkout to save 40%. TikTok hater, where's your website? What's your discount code? Bitch, I've already won. Okay, we're going to put this on, um, put your pan on medium heat. Okay, put your pan, put your pan on medium heat real good. See? And then let me tell you what I got. A little tinge of ground chicken. Now ground chicken comes in two types. Please don't play with me. Alright. I'm being nice, but I will read you for filth. Alright? TikTok. Play nice. I promise you. You're gonna end up blocking me. I ain't star with you. I never star. But goddammit, I will finish. You understand me? Ask the kitchenista. Ask them people in that Darius Crooks hate group. They've been trying to stop me for three years. Bitch, I'm still a millionaire. All right? If I were you, I would tread very, very lightly. I'm saved, but I'm still a work in progress. I will pray for you and then cuss you out. In Jesus' name. Now, put you a skillet on medium heat and get you a little piece of olive oil. 
Put your little olive oil in here. Okay? Put your little taste of olive oil, a little taste of olive oil in here. And then, you know what I do have left over? I got some onion and bell pepper. It ain't on. Um... Girl, now I thought I had onion and bell. I done got shame, child. Child, I done. Oh, no, here it is right here. I'm finna say, I done got shamed, okay? Just dice onion and bell pepper. Whatever kind of bell pepper you got, whatever is on sale, okay? If green is on sale, use green. Don't forget, the new knife set is on sale. Shop Dairy, it's expensive. I'm not gonna lie to you. These knives, this one is $99 by itself, okay? This one, 99 this one 99, this one 79, this one they expensive. So go on there and get the set. The set is 349, but you could save 40% off 349 while I'm live. Okay. If the green don't sell, use the green. If the red don't sell, use the red. If the purple don't sell, use the purple. If the pink don't sell, Use the pink. The, the idea is you need to use whatever's on sale. Okay? So I got onion and bell pepper. Honey, and I didn't put the, clearly I didn't take the water out of the pan because the pan is really going crazy. Okay, the pan is really panning. Oh, and FYI, let me just say this. The Darius cooks everyday skillet is the best skillet you will ever own in your life. Okay? Hands down, bar none, there is no skillet on the market nowhere better than this skillet. Just FYI. Okay? That is not that is not conjecture. That is not hypotheses. That is a fact. There is no skillet better than that one, okay? Onion and bell pepper are gonna go in there. Along with a pound of ground chicken. Now ground chicken comes in two ways, white meat or dark meat. Get the dark meat, if you can. The dark meat got more flavor. The darker the berry, the sweeter the juice. <laughs> okay? The darker the berry, the sweeter the juice. Also, my six piece utensil set is also available for sale as well, 40% off. This is the long-handled gold spatula, the long-handled spaghetti fork, the long-handled spade, the long-handled strainer, the long-handled ladle, and the long-handled spoon, all right? This is also available at shopdariuscooks.com. Use the code cupcake at checkout, all right? Let's check this oven. Ooh, you looking good. Take your time. I ain't going to rush you. They're looking good. Let's bust this meat up. Meet up before it be too late. You know, you know what I'm trying to tell you. You only got a um, little bit of time to bust it up before it be too late. Okay, you only got a little bit of time to bust your meat up. You need some garlic in your life. Okay, you need some garlic in your life. Let's just slice the garlic up. 
Can y'all see the slication? Let me see if I can show you. How much are the skillets? They 40% off, child. I don't know. Okay. Garlic. How many cloves of garlic you want to use? As many as you need. Okay, let's put the garlic in there. It's about four cloves of garlic sliced up real good. Like four cloves. That's all you need, right? About four, four, five, five, six. Put that in there and mix that together. Now, up until this point, we have not seasoned our situation okay there's no seasoning on here yet so we're going to add all the things that make this taste amazing thank you let me grab two more ingredients out of the pantry actually more than two shit i need some of this I need some of this. I definitely need some of this and some of this. Okay, here I come, y'all. I got everything I need. Okay, I'm gonna bring the pot over here so we can season it in front of y'all so y'all can see it, okay? I'm doing this for you because I love you. For me to you. I hope life treats you kind. And I hope you have all you dreamed of. Woo! A few more minutes. And I wish you joy. And happiness. But above all this, I wish you love. That's um chicken bouillon, dry thyme, red pepper flakes for a little bit of spice. Let me tell you why I went this past weekend. She's anointed. I don't know if she on here or not. Y'all got to tag her. Baby, let me tell you where I went. I was in Sacramento, California. Sacramento, California, food ain't good worth shit. You understand? <laughs> I'm sorry, Sacramento, but y'all don't have no good food like that. Okay? Y'all might as well join Detroit. Detroit, shut up. I want to hear your mouth. You might as well join Detroit, and you might as well join um, Memphis. Okay? Sacramento is just all right. It gives just okay, except for that lady. Oh, onion pepper. i just season it, child, with some stuff. What do I put in here? Red pepper flake, thyme, Italian seasoning, garlic powder, onion powder, and I got dried fennel. Put that in. Okay, a little fennel seed. I was at this lady place called Tori's Place. Now, let me tell you about Tori's Place. Tori's Place is the place is a dump. And the people kept saying, people kept saying, why do you keep calling this place a dump, Darius? Have you been there? Okay. It was tough, man. Hold on, I don't like the way this one look. I don't like the way this one look. Got a little spot I don't like. But the rest of them, they look all right. Huh? The rest of the cupcakes, they look good. You see that? Huh? 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 <laughs> huh? 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 
Let them cool off. And then we can take this off as well. I don't know if this glass is going to break or not. I hope it don't. But this is the um, the filling for our peach cobbler cupcakes. Lovely. This is the filling now for our peach cobbler cupcakes. I was hoping it didn't break. It like it's gonna be all right. All right. I'm not putting it in the refrigerator because you know the end of the crap. Okay. Okay. My chicken is cooked through. Why don't we add some tomato paste? Once the, the chicken is cooked, let's add in some tomato paste in the bottom of this pan. I'm gonna move this pan over here so y'all can see it a little better because you really can't see it over there. They're good. I'm doing this for y'all. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, a couple of tablespoons of tomato paste are gonna go in there. Okay, and we're going to bloom the tomato paste. What does that mean to bloom the tomato paste? We're going to let the tomato sit in there a little bit. Have a little fun. Become one with the chicken. Mm. It was in Sacramento. It's a dump. You sit outside under a makeshift ceiling in the heat with the flies. It was the worst dining experience in my life. But that food was a 47 out of five. I don't care what you say about Tori. And I do not care how you slice it or dice it. The woman's hands are anointed. Do you understand me? I could not believe how good that food was. I said, sis, I don't know what you got going on, but baby, this food is amazing. It was so good. It was delicious, okay? All right, I'm dousing it with a little bit of red, uh, red wine. Whatever you got laying around. Um, a Cabernet, a uh, uh, Melbot. I mean, it doesn't really matter. Whatever you got, right? Um, a Merlot. It doesn't matter. Any red wine will work in the background of this. And we need to I think about tomato action here. So... I do have a can of crushed tomato, like a tomato puree. And this will be great because this will build, it'll build our sauce. The pan is already seasoned, so this is just gonna add lovely, beautiful, juicy tomato flavor. Okay. So as soon as that wine cooks out, We can go to town. Let me see what we got going on. Okay, we got action. Ooh, oh, it's cooked out. It's gone. Look at that. You see that? Chicken is seasoned and whatnot. That's gone. So let's add in can of tomatoes. I am not Italian, but I'm smart. And the one thing I know you're supposed to do, rinse the can, put that in there, back on the stove. Now we cut the heat down to a medium at this point and let the uh, oven or let the stove do the rest of the work. 
I am going to add a little bit of sugar in there, okay? I don't want to hear your mouth. I'm from Chicago. That's what we do, all right? I don't give a shit if you don't put it in yours. You should, all right? It helps balance it, cut out the acid, deal with it. Okay? Put your little sugar in here. Come on. Okay. And let it hang out. I'm going to give it a stir, put it on a simmer. Oh, yeah. Ooh. And you know what would be great with this? If you did a big batch of sauce or gravy, do it like on a Sunday, slow cooked and whatnot. And then um, you can take it, portion it, put it in the freezer. So whenever you're ready for spaghetti or lasagna or quick pasta, you're ready to go. All right. Speaking of ready to go, so are the knives. The knives are in stock. We have a four piece knife set. This is the chef's knife. You guys have this one. I done changed, this is my last time changing the handle. The first handle was blue, like this one. Then the second handle was black, like this one, right? Now the third handle is blonde, like this one. But I just see, I'm done, I'm not changing it no more. I'm not doing anything else, that's it. Uh, are there any more gold utensils? Somebody said the gold utensils are sold out. Let me go look. I got gold utensils in sale on stock. Hold on one second. Gold utensils. Gold. U T E N. Oh, it do say sold out. Hold on. Let me get you a few more on there. Hold on one second. Edit. One. I know I got at least 100 sets. At least 100. I'm adding them right now for you. You got the black one? Hold on, I'm adding it right now. I'm doing it right now. They were sold out. Give me six, five, four, three, two. They're in stock. Okay, all right, let's get some pasta going. Stock pot, get some water. All right, let me get this water on boil. And this is also a good time to uh, check your sauce as well, right? Because you really want to make sure the sauce is like balanced and it's got the right amount of flavor and great things are happening. So let me just give it a little taste just to make sure I'm rocking and rolling with all my flavors. Let me see. Mm. Uh. Oh my God, that's so good, y'all. It ain't even done cooking yet, and it's so good. The tomatoes have like this acid, but that sugar helps balance it. And that little bit of red pepper flake shines through there like nobody's business, baby. I tell you, it's so good. Mm. The discount code is the word cupcake. Okay? Cupcake. What y'all doing? Y'all all right? What's going on? What y'all what y'all up to? Uh oh, we gotta block somebody. Hold on. Drew, you ready to get blocked? Hold on one second. 
Okay, what up? TikTok. Do I need to block Drew? Yes or no? I'm going to let Drew go. Drew ain't do nothing? Oh, oh, they said let Drew go. Oh, fuck. Okay, Drew, you out, bro. Block. Confirm. He gone. He got to go. He gone, baby. Thank you for telling me, TikTok. I appreciate it. Drewski, he gone. He was cutting up. He ain't cutting up no more. And he better not bring that shit to Facebook or Instagram. Bye, Drew. We ain't gonna hold you. You you look good. Going. I got some catfish. Bitch, I got some catfish. Real catfish. Not that bossum. What is that? Why do y'all eat that? And why do y'all eat tilapia? Y'all get on my nerve. Y'all be eating stuff my grandma ain't never ate in her whole life. This is a real southern catfish fillet. Two of them. Okay? Oh, wait. They flew out of my hand. Child. Hold on. Okay. I'm going to cut the catfish up a little bit. Like in half. Okay? But on a diagonal like this. See? Who else need the block? Blocking you blesses me. Ooh, blocking you blesses me. If you try, we gonna let you flack us. Blocking you blesses me. Hey, blocking you blesses me. Oh, blocking you blesses me. If you try, we gonna let you fly. Cause blocking you blesses me. Blesses me. Blesses me. Blesses me. Blocking you blesses me. Huh? I love it. What does blocking do? Huh? It blesses me. Now we got season our catfish. A little Tony's. A little, because you know Tony's be a lot. Okay, which I don't know what's in here, but if you ever try to find somebody hiding in the closet, throw some Tonys in there. They'll start sneezing in a second. I found him! <laughs> a little red pepper flake. What else I got? I got some onion powder somewhere? Yeah, I got stuff. I got a little onion powder. Granulated. A little Italian seasoning or herbs day. Provence. Put you a little bit. You don't need that much. You don't need a whole lot. Put you a little bit in there. Like this. I need a little smoked paprika. Hello. If you ain't see if you ain't sneezing, it ain't seasoned. The dumbest shit I ever heard. <laughs> the dumbest shit I ever heard in my life. I got some old bay over here. Where I'm putting it in there. How bad could that could that hurt? A little taint your old bay. Little taint. Little taint your smoked paprika. Like that much. That's all you need. A little bit. Y'all be putting the whole bottle in there. So I said, why that taste like that, girl? Same thing I'm asking. I don't know shit. All right, let me see what kind of pasta I got over here. Ain't got much. Look like all I had more than this. Oh, Lord Jesus. Uh-oh. 
I thought I had more. Well, you know what? This is perfect for me. I thought I had more pasta. Somebody didn't check the inventory. This all I got. <laughs> a third of a box of spaghetti. I thought I had some more. And it's too late when you go to the store now. So I'm going to have to use this. It's going to be what it's going to be. Sorry. Anybody but me, no way. Put you some salt in there. And you're going to put this little piece of pasta. We ain't got that much. This is more. I got gastric bypass. This is enough for me. It's actually more than enough for me, if I can be honest with you. And this ain't even spaghetti. It's linguine, but we're going to use what we got. Okay. Put your linguine in there. Let it sit up in there with the salty water. And then on the fish, we got to put some buttermilk on this. Okay. It's enough for me. It ain't enough for me and somebody else. You know what I'm saying? A little buttermilk. From somebody's farm. Where does this come from? Marburger Farm Dairy. They Jamaican. They didn't say dairy farm. They said farm dairy. Jamaicans do that. They say stuff backwards. Good night, hello. Right? Where's the shirt red? They, they say stuff backwards. The same thing here. They put, this is the gourmet buttermilk farm dairy. It's supposed to be dairy farm. They, they backwards. It's all right. Everybody can't be saying. Uh, everybody can't make it to heaven. This is Sister Mary L. McCracken. I am with the Holy Ghost Takeover. I'm fired up. I truly am. I want you to know I'm fired up. And then what she said? All right, hold on. I put my stuff back. I put this back. I want to put this back. Because cleanliness is next to God. Okay, so all I have is my catfish seeds. I'm putting it to the side. I'm gonna deal with that in one second, okay? Let's deal with this pasta. Cause the pasta is looking like it's doing something. It is, but it ain't ready yet. All right, I got sauce and pasta working. Cupcakes are cooled and Peach cobbler filling is also cool. Why don't we do a little taste test? Now, this is a peach cobbler filling that we filled with that peach cobbler filling and that beautiful, it's still hot, that beautiful, lovely um, peach crown. It looks like caramel, but it's actually peach. Listen, you got to put lemon juice in the filling. Okay? You got to put lemon juice in the filling. The lemon juice really cuts through the heaviness of all of that, and it really comes out, and it really is some kind of amazing. Put this in the freezer. Let it get cold. While we work on the rest of our stuff, okay? Let me get this pasta. Let me see if this pasta is ready. Eh, almost. Let me grab the mixer. Hold the line, please, while I do that. Thank you. I'm looking for a miracle. Expect the impossible. Just believe and see it. And God will restore it today. Hey. Hey. Okay. Mixer. You can do this by um with a hand mixer too, but I don't have one. Okay. If I had one, I would use it, but I don't have one, so I'm not using it. Oh, 
Hold on, pull it out the um, paddle. I mean the whisk. Sorry. All right, let's do this, y'all. Let's make a little magic happen. Here we go, bottom of the mixer. What do we need? Now, I don't know, let me tell you something. Huh? Nashville? Come here. Nashville. Oh, don't forget, if you need a, if you need a copy of a cookbook, any one of the new knives, the gold cocktail kit, all of it's on sale right now while I'm live. Shop DariusCooks.com. The gold cocktail kit is so cute. Look at it. Let me show it to you. Before I get Memphis, I mean Nashville together. This is the gold cocktail kit. She's cute. Okay. Shop DariusCooks.com. Thank you. Use the code. Um, I forgot the code. What's the code? Use the code. Uh, cupcake. At checkout, okay. Let me drain this pasta, y'all, because I don't want it to overcook. You have to oversalt the water and undercook the pasta, okay? You with it? You know, mix it for this. You cannot do this by hand. You could, but you'll be doing this till sometime next year. We need some cream cheese. I got a stick, a block. Eight ounces. And you want the cream cheese to be cold. Amen? Cold cream cheese. Not room temperature cream cheese. Cold cream cheese. A block of cream cheese in. We need some sugar. I'm going to be using all purpose. I mean, <laughs> Regular sugar. <laughs> you can use um, powder sugar if you want to. I don't got none, so. And I don't like it too sweet. So put you a little sugar in there. Wait, that's about to be too much. Okay, that's. Oh, oh, oh! Well, hold on. <laughs> you know, the devil would be busy. The devil be busy and he be letting too much come out that needs to come out. Hold on. Let me just get a little bit of this out. Okay, that's enough. Act like you ain't see that. Okay, you ain't see nothing. Act like you didn't see that. Okay. Okay, put you a little, put that on. And you want to mix that sugar with the um cream cheese. Cold. Zesty self. Your daddy zesty too. Now what? Me and your daddy, we zesty together. Call me your step daddy. Who you doing? Stepson. Okay, once the sugar is dissolved real good, add you the other two ingredients, a little swig of vanilla, or a lot of swig, and you need some heavy cream, heavy whipping cream in here. This is gonna make it light and fluffy. I do not know what they was doing down in Nashville. Honey, I don't know, but it is not the needs be. The bee's knee. It's not the bee's knee. Okay? <laughs> I said... I said, girl, what is this? Babe, those cupcakes were so dry. I'm so sorry. And their frosting was not of God. I'm so sorry. In fact, I want a little more. I want mine to be whipped a little more. Hold on. 
I'm not lying. That frosting was not, it was not eat. I said, what is this? Who supposed to eat this? And y'all was like, there he is. We only get the sweet potato. She wasn't that good either. She was all right. Then when I said she was all right, y'all was like, oh, you tripping. Oh, you tripping. Something wrong with you. Okay. Then something is wrong with me. Okay. Then something is wrong with me. Use the discount code uh, cupcake at checkout. Now see, this is frosty. What that other stuff was? Now see, baby, this here, baby, this is frosty. Okay. What was that other stuff? I don't know what that was, but this here is a proper whipped cream cheese frosty. Okay, I know what the other stuff was. I'm not really sure what that was. Okay, but if it's not like this, chances are I don't want it. Mm. Oh, that is so good. Four ingredients heavy cream. Oh, heavy cream, cream cheese, sugar, vanilla. That's it. Not in the order, though. You got to put the cream cheese and the sugar in there first. Once that's done, then you can put the rest of your stuff in there, all right? Okay, hold on. Let me get this together. All right. Now, let's talk about, I bought me a little kit, a little cupcake decorating kit. So gay. <laughs> He was right. I am zesty. I am so gay. Anytime a cup, a cupcake decorating kit gets you excited, there's a problem. Okay. Here's my piping bag, but we need to outfit it with the right tip. Okay. So for the tip, oh look, they even have one where you could do like um, you could squeeze the stuff inside. Oh, this is cute. Amazon, child. Amazon. I don't want this one. I don't want this one. I don't want that one. I'll take this one. Amazon. You, you really are gay if you know how to decorate cupcakes. That really is something. If you know how to decorate a cupcake, you're gay as shit. I don't give a fuck what they say. <laughs> I don't care what they say. Oh, here for a plastic one. Let me use that one. I'd rather use the plastic one. Okay, I'm gonna decorate a whole cupcake. What straight man is sitting up on the internet decorating cupcakes? None. None. Not am one. Except for my gay ass. What are you doing? Okay, come on, y'all. Let's do this. <laughs> Okay, this is so gay. We need to fry our fish. Put, put the, let me put the grease on at least. Let me get the grease hot for the fish. Or oh, you know what I could do? I'm gonna fry it in the deep fryer. Hold on, y'all. Let me put the grease in the deep fryer on. We'll do it like that. That's how we gonna do it. Okay, we'll do it like that. We'll get it hot. And then we'll come back and have a little fun with that. Okay? Okay, let's get these cupcakes together. So we need to fit this tip <laughs> into this hole. <laughs> we need <laughs> we need to fit this tip into this hole, okay? I want you to start off with, oh, Chris says she on TikTok blocking, block him, honey. Okay, Zesty, your mama Zesty. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna have to put this in here. So you make a small hole first, okay? That way 
if you make a big hole, it's gonna be too much and then you're gonna be shamed. So this is probably too small, but just to make sure, we'll put the tip in the bottom like this is. So you're gonna press it down. Clearly, it's not enough. So you will cut off a little bit more and then we're gonna push it down more. It's still not enough, okay? So this is what you do a little bit at a time until you get to something that's almost, we got a little centimeter. I don't even know how much a centimeter is. I just said that because it sounded good, but cut off, cut off a little more. Okay, now we in business, okay? Now we in business. So what we'll do, Oh, TikTok just ended for whatever reason. Hold on. I don't know. TikTok just took me. Um, I don't even know. Hold on. I don't know. Oh, let me see. I don't know. Oh, well. If you're watching on TikTok, for whatever reason, TikTok just shut down. So anyway, good thing I'm not monetized over there. Okay, so a little bit of uh, frosting, not a little bit, but a lot of frosting, goes into here. Okay, now you want to get a smaller spatula for this little bitty bag, but this is all I got, so... I'm gonna make a little bit of a mess, but I'm gonna try to do it without making too much of a mess, okay? Eh, let me see. Okay. Then we can close up the top and you just wanna twist, right? Get a little bit of that air out like that. Okay, so now you've got, you got your stuff ready to go, see? Boom. Now, <coughs> Let's talk about our beautiful, lovely cupcakes, okay? They're baked up. These are regular vanilla bean cupcakes that look beautiful, right? They do. Before we deal with that, I'm thinking about a garnish, if you will, okay? Thinking about a garnish and thinking about how I want this to look, right? So I definitely want peaches on top. So I'm going to cut out some of this peach. Now you can use fresh peaches if you want to, all right? Them shits be hard as a rock, okay? All right, shits be hard as a rock, okay? All right, that's enough. Here we go, let's grab the filling out the freezer. It's cool enough that we can deal with it, all right? And I'm just gonna push out a little bit of the middle of the cupcake. Right, just push out the middle, right? And then you know what we do with this. Thanks, okay? You know what we do with this? Oh, it's delicious. Oh, it's delicious. See, that's what I'm saying. It, the cupcake gotta be moist. Then they're gonna say, oh, we like dry cupcakes. No, you don't. Nobody likes a dry cupcake. It's gotta be moist and like ooey gooey. You know what I'm saying? You be don't let half doing stuff. Mm -mm. I don't like that. Okay, come on. So we're gonna cut out the middle like this, see? And that way we got some place for that filling to go. Put your spoon. Get your spoon and you'll take a little bit of that filling and spoon that filling on on the inside of that cupcake. Fill it up. Fill it up. 
Okay. Beautiful. Mm. 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 Okay. Then you take the. Now you can do this a couple different ways. A cute way to do this is do a circle around, right? So you start at point one and you just do a circle around. That's a really cute way to do your cupcake. Or I like a dollop. So a dollop for me is. Frosting in the middle, like that. That is my personal favorite way to do a cupcake. If I could ask, if I could be honest, my own personal way. Okay, and then what I'll do is I'll take one of the peach slices, see? And then I'll cut the peach slices up and throw the peach slices right on top of here. Now, if you wanted to, you could do a little cinnamon sugar situation. That'll do you some good as well, see? Okay, you could do a little cinnamon sugar situation, but this, hold on one second, let me get up in this camera real fast. Hold on, put this to the side, put this to the side, I'm gonna lean over here, hold on one second. See, this, a cupcake, okay? The inside of the cupcake is moist. Inside of the cupcake is moist. You peel this back. Now, I ain't no way this finna be bad. You see what I'm saying? Ain't no goddamn way this finna be bad. See, this is what you do. See, and then you bite into it like this is. See, watch that. Look at that. Here I come. Look at that. See what I'm saying? See what I mean? You see what I mean? It's a whole different ball game. All right? When the cupcake is done right, it's moist. It's juicy. And it's flavorful. You see that? It's flavorful. It's not half cocked, half put together. It's delicious and beautiful. And I'm gonna get full, but I gotta take this last bite. If you're going to make a cupcake, if you're going to make a cupcake, it's got to be like this, bro. If you're going to make a cupcake, I'm going to be like, yo, all the other shits y'all be making, I don't know what that is. But this is what I like. All right, come on, let's make this fish right fast okay let's make this fish right fast come on oh that's a cupcake for your ass right there boy mm, that's delicious moist that buttermilk plays beautifully with that baking soda and it leaves a beautiful lovely component to our dish all right all right, let's talk about this fish for one second. Where is it? Right here. Let's get a glove on. And this is the fish that's been sitting in buttermilk marinating. That cupcake is so good, y'all. Oh, that thing is right, boy. Mm. With that filling on the inside, oh, it's so good. Beyond, it's delicious. 
All right, buttermilk and seasoned fish is all hanging out. And look at how juicy this is, right? Like, look at how seasoned. If it ain't seasoned like this, I don't want it. All right, look at how seasoned this is. If it ain't seasoned like this, baby, I don't want it. Just let you know, all right? Now, if you need anything from our online store, you've got about 10 more minutes before I'm done. You can go to shopdariuscooks.com and you can use the code uh, cupcake at checkout to save 40% while I am live, okay? I'm using flour. You can certainly use cornmeal if you like, but I like flour in mine. It just, it is what it is. It's what I like. You know, do what you like in yours. It's totally okay. You'll be fine. All right, nobody's going to hate you. If you want to do cornmeal, do cornmeal. I just happen to be a fan of the flour. And sometimes I'll do like flour, I'll do flour and cornstarch. You know, it just depends. I, I'll play around with it from here and there and just let my heart, my heart's desire run wild, okay? Remember that pasta sauce? It's been simmering, you didn't know that. All right, the pasta sauce has been simmering all this time. Look at that. It's been simmering. This is that ground chicken ragu with the red wine, the chicken stock, the dried basil, the dried fennel, a little bit of sugar. It's been simmering and this thing can simmer another couple of hours and it would be um, even that much more amazing. Oh God. It needs a touch of chicken bouillon. Just that much, all right? All right, let me get a skillet ready because I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna put this pasta and this fish together, all right? Another skillet. And I'm going for medium high heat. But I think my oil is ready on my fish. So let's drop the fish in the grease. All right. And let's see what she does. Hold on. Oh, yes. Woo! Hold on, y'all. It's frying, boy. Fry, Jesus, fry. All right, I'm gonna put two in, and I'm gonna save the other two for tomorrow. And while that fish is frying, let's talk about how I wanna prepare my pasta, all right? My pasta is ready to go. It's cooked off. I wanna get this sauce into a skillet. But I also wanna get my pasta ready to toss in there as well, okay? So let me show you how this works. Pasta sauce is here. Let's get a ladle. Into the skillet she goes. the sauce goes into a skillet. I'm going to marry that pasta sauce with some shredded cheese. Whatever kind you like. Whatever is on sale, that's what we use. All right? Pasta goes in. I mean, a cheese goes in. And then so does the sauce, all right? I mean, the pasta. <laughs> so does the pasta. All right, we'll give that a stir like this. Oh. And the idea is to mix all of that pasta and sauce together. I need some more sauce, I don't have enough.
Beautiful. There we go. That's plenty. All right, let's give this a quick little zhuzh. Oh, all right. And then back on the stove for just a few seconds so that it heats through. And then all that cheese can melt. I just gotta do one last thing for you. That's it. One last thing and then we will be done, okay? The last thing I wanna do is I really want hot sauce for my fish. I ain't got no Parmesan, girl. She's talking about some Parmesan. If you got Parmesan, use that. I ain't got no Parmesan cheese. I got cheddar cheese. That's what I'm finna use. I use what I got. I don't have that. She said Parmesan. Did you see me put Parmesan in? I ain't got none. That's all I got. What you want me to do? All I can do is use what I have. All right, let's talk about this hot sauce for one second, okay? You can use your favorite kind of hot sauce. It don't really matter what kind of hot sauce you use. Use your favorite one. I had some crystals earlier, but it's all gone. And this all I got left. So it's like I ain't got no Parmesan cheese. I ain't got no Louisiana hot sauce. I got Cholula. The A. Shit. Now, what you want me to do? That's all I got. It's Cholula. She good though. Cholula is delicious. That garlic one, it be real garlicky, don't it? And some honey. You know what we call that? Honey hot sauce. We played it separately. Do me a favor. Get out of my comment section talking about how you plate your food. Okay? Please do me a favor. Would you please get out of my comment section about you plate your spaghetti separately? I don't give two shits. You was not here with me for to eat this. What the hell do I care? Huh? What do I care? I don't. All right? You was not going to eat this. Please go somewhere and let me alone. All right? Oh, we played it separately. Ain't the fuck you eating the same thing? At some point, you can plate the shit separately. When you go to the commode and you sit your end on the goddamn toilet, do it come out separate? Come on. When you go to the commode, shopdariuscooks.com, <laughs> Use the code uh, cupcake at checkout to save 40, 40%. When you go to the commode, how I come out? I, I didn't think so. See? I did not think so. You played it separately but you shit it together. Sometimes y'all priorities be in the wrong place, I think, if you ask me. You ain't really ask me, but I'm gonna tell you what I think. Bitch, cause ain't no way you gonna tell me you shits this out and it come out separate. How it come out? Together, right? That's what I thought. I'm going to tell me some fresh basil on top of my pasta. Because I like fresh basil. I'm bougie. Okay? I'm just tearing fresh basil. I'm not cutting it. I'm tearing it. What the Italians do. 
Let me check this fish. Hold on. Oh, she ready. Come on, bow your head. Don't forget. Everything on the site. Wine glasses. Knife set. Cookbooks. You name it. It's on the website for you. All you got to do is go to shopdariuscooks.com. Use the code cupcake at checkout to save 40%. At this moment, please bow your head and say grace. Grace. This is not spaghetti. It's chicken ragu over linguine. But you can call it spaghetti if you want to. Mm. Mm. Oh my God. Y'all, talk about seasoned, flavorful. Oh my God. Okay, last bite, last bite. Oh my God. Last bite. Do I feel like doing 50%? Mm. Mm. You got 10 minutes. You got 10 minutes. Hold on. Hold on. Just for you. Discounts. Cupcake. I tell you what. I tell you what. It's 923. 60% off. For 10 minutes. 60% off. Use the code cupcake at checkout. You got 10 minutes. When the 10 minutes is up, I do not want to hear your mouth, okay? Legit. Bro, you got 10 minutes. 60% off for 10 minutes. Hit it. I'm, I'm not playing with y'all. I'm not playing at 9.33. The code is deactivated. Do you understand me? 9.33, the code is deactivated. 60%. What was that about my fish being burnt? What was that about my fish being burnt? I thought somebody said my fish was burnt. Did I, did I hear that in the comment section? I thought somebody said in the comment section the fish was burnt. I thought I heard that. I'm not sure who said it, but In fact, I know exactly who said it. Linda, Linda, pin comment. That's who said it. Honey hot sauce. Over a little taint of fish. 
Uf. 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 This is hot. Remember that thing is hot there, boy. Linda said your fish is burning. Linda, this burnt to you? All right, you have officially four, seven minutes left. I'm gonna stay on with you for seven minutes. You have seven minutes. There are currently 635 people shopping on my online store right now. 635, you literally have Six minutes until the discount code is deactivated. You got six minutes. ShopDariusCooks.com. The discount code is Cupcake for 60% off. You got six minutes. Huh? Shop Darius Cooks. Dot com. Use the discount code Cupcake at checkout to save 60% for the next six minutes. That's everything including the new cookware. This includes the tangerine and gold, nine by 13, the pearl and gold, the crimson and gold, and the emerald and gold, 60% off for the next five minutes. All right? You got five minutes. Shop DariusCooks.com. You got five minutes. Okay? You got five minutes. I'm going to stay on with you for a little bit. I get it. I know it's tough. Oh, I got to earn money on TikTok? Jesus Christ. All right, you got four minutes. Four minutes. I'm going to stick right here with you. Currently, there are 795 people checking out. No, nope, you got four minutes left. Four. ShopDariusCooks.com. Use the code CUPCAKE at checkout. You have four minutes left. Don't worry, I blocked her. Four minutes left. Do I have the cancers? Yeah. Here, let me, if they sold out, let me, re, let me restock them real fast. Hold on. Uh, decanters. Yep. I am going to put 100 on the site right now. Oh, maybe I don't have any decanters. I don't have any. Sorry. I thought I did. I don't have, if I don't have it on the site, I don't have it. My bad. My bad. I don't have that. The knives are sold out. Let me see. The cutting board is sold out. Yeah, I don't have no more cutting boards. But knives. Let me see. 
Nope, knives are in stock. The Everyday Knife Set and the Chef Knife, they're both available on the site. You now have three minutes left. You now have three minutes left. You want the wine glasses? We should have wine glasses in stock. Let me see. Y'all sold them out that fast? Nope, we got wine glasses in stock. Shows the pressure cooker, but when I click on it, it shows the skillet. Then scroll to the pressure cooker. I cannot restock the cutting board. I don't have any more. I don't have any more. I'm out. You have two minutes left. Two minutes left. All right. 784 of you online shopping right this moment. You've got two minutes left. The code is the word cupcake. All right. Now, let me go so I can finish eating my dinner and uh, Instagram, I'll see you shortly. Two things I want to tell you as I always do. Food is my life. Life is my food. Until next time. I got to wish you a happy cooking from my heart to yours. You have two minutes left. I'll see you on the other side. Bye, everybody. Great live tonight. This was amazing. <laughs>